Hey, what's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Seven Days. It is the morning of day number four. And tonight we do have a horde tonight. So I do want to get over to the base. So I left this door open. That wasn't smart of me. But yeah, I do want to uh, go ahead and get over to the base this morning. I know we do have a job to do for Trader Hugh. Um, but I do want to stop by the base really quick so we can go ahead and make sure that we get some upgrades done and we can pretty much go from there. Um, because once the horde starts, you know, we're going to be, once it gets closer, I should say, to the horde, which is going to be hour 18, um, it's going to be a bit of a scramble to get some of that stuff done. So I kind of want to try to do that. Um, as early as possible. Our cube fortress is looking pretty nice, I gotta say. Um, I also do want to put in a roof, so that's going to be something that I do want to work on. So let's go ahead and get some some uh, wood, and let's go ahead and get some stone, and then uh, we'll see what time it is. So I think that's a decent amount of wood for now. Um, I do want to try to find a big uh, uh, stone stump. I don't want to use or harvest those little circles because uh, they don't give us the maximum amount of stone. So I'm on the lookout for that. Uh, let's repair our ax while we're at it. Let's see if there's any honey in this real quick. Then uh, hopefully we can find something soon. I mean, if we do head over to the job right now, we might be able to find something. Hopefully. Um, yeah, but I don't, I don't see anything close by at this point. Ah, here's a stone stump. Oh, this is right next to our spawn. All right. Well, let's go ahead and. Mark this on the map. I'll just put a uh, stone hill here. There we go. Let's go ahead and get some of this real quick, and then we'll knock out that job. Yeah, I heard you behind me, lady. Not very sneaky. I'll tell you that much. There we go. Okay, so it's further in, but it's nowhere over there because that that side didn't shrink. So it's got to be over here somewhere. Get out of here, Kenneth. I'm busy. Oh, there it is. Wow, it was like way in the corner. What the heck? Alright, well, we'll ditch the sandwich, we'll ditch the cornmeal. Take everything else, I guess. Let's get out of here. Alright. Bring it on. Uh, we'll probably have, we'll probably do another job if we got time. I kind of want to see if I can put the roof in. As a matter of fact, um, I think we'll go ahead and make 200 of those. We'll have to get a little bit more wood. And then we also do need to make sure we make more cobblestone tonight, just so we have stuff uh, on us to make repairs when it's absolutely uh, necessary. Chicken! You ain't going anywhere, chicken. All right, what's up, Hugh? What Back from the job. 
Grave Digger got some 762. We actually have a gold digger head. or grave digger mod, gold digger mod. <laughs> uh, yeah, can't use any gold digger mods. Is I mean, unless it's for Jen, because all she does is take our money. Um, but I think we should probably go with the 762 since tonight is horde night. I don't plan on taking another buried supplies. So that's a pretty good get. Um, let's see what other jobs. We got a tier one clear zombies, so we'll take that. Um, I'm not going to do that right now, though. Let's go get some repair work done at the base. Um, and then if we have some time after that, we'll check and see what time it is, and we will go from there. Um, unlucky rabbit. And, uh, yeah, that's what we'll go ahead and do. Alright, here we are. Let's, uh, let's actually, uh, pop this open real quick. So what we need to do right here is uh, I was planning on making a storage that was outside of this and I didn't want to connect it to the actual base. But what I'm thinking is that since we have a decent amount of room here, uh, we can go ahead and do that. Because what I'm just going to go ahead and do is I'm just going to make it double thick for the walls, you know. Um, so yeah, so that way, if there's any explosions or anything, from like any cops or, or anything like that, um, it should be pretty well protected. Oops. There we go. And all we need to do is just put in a door. So this will be our storage area. We'll be able to make um, just a few storage crates, nothing crazy. And uh, we'll be able to line up some storage along this wall here and then extend it out over here as well. And then we'll put our uh, forges and work uh, workbenches here. So yeah, it'll be fine. All right, let's uh, let's get to work. drop where are you dropping it oh that's actually uh, not too far let's uh, mark it like this drop scene and oh it marks it on the map I'll just save it anyway I don't feel like just getting rid of that right now. We'll just leave it the way it is. We'll go get that if we have any time left after finishing upgrades to the base. And uh, we might just save that job for tomorrow morning, given that we survived the horde tonight.
All right, so with this base, I'm just gonna kind of try to go as high as I can. I don't think I'll have time to really do anything else at this point. So I'm just gonna go an extra layer up here because I don't want them to see a way to just pile onto each other and start beating on any blocks above. So I think that's pretty much what we're gonna do. We're just gonna spend the remaining amount of time just fortifying the bottom layer of this base because um, we might have to go get some more stone um, we might have to do a little bit more mining for wood um, i think i might put in a skill point when it comes to doing like harvesting like mother load or something like that because uh we need to make sure that we are fully prepared for tonight There we are. Gonna put some uh, ramps up top. And I guess we'll do all this just because it's at the front. And uh, I think we'll just put like a little uh, thing right here over the top. Just so they're just not incentivized, you know, to climb up top here. I think that's gonna be good. All right, let's go ahead and get some more stone. I'm actually, since we're a little bit limited on time, I don't wanna have to try to run all the way back to that little stone mountain place, that stone hill. It's going to be a bit of a trip, so we're just going to do with what we got here for now. Let's go ahead and put in a point into uh, Mother Load, or Miner 69er. Um, stamina cost is reduced by 8%, 15% power attacks. I don't know, is it Mother Load that's better? Yeah, 20% more. All right, let's do that and Mother Load. Why not? And then I'm going to put another point into strength, and I'm also going to put another point... Oh, we need to go one more for strength. So we could start getting 10 stamina for each killing blow. Um, yeah, I think we're just going to go ahead and bite the bullet, do another skill point, and then that other skill point that we get, we'll start getting some stamina back. All right, so that's pretty much done. Um, we're not going to have time to go get the, um, what do you call it, the drop. We're just, we're just not going to have time to do that. I'm wondering if I should change this back into stairs. You know? Let's do that. Change, uh, nah, screw it. We'll, we'll leave it the way it is. Yeah, we'll, we'll leave it the way it is.
All right, so we got the walls double thick. I'm going to go ahead and lay down this storage right here, just for now. We're going to chuck everything that we don't need. We're going to keep the food on us. Um, we're going to need the cobblestone, obviously. I'm going to chuck the meat in there. Actually, I'm going to take the meat because I'm going to try to see if we can get that going. The arrows can stay. We don't need repair kits right now. Um, shovel can go inside. So can the bow. We'll keep the knife. We might need the knife. We're definitely going to need the pipe bombs. Rifle we're not going to need right now. Uh, wood. We'll keep it on us. Uh, we don't really need it, actually. Don't need that. Um, yeah, stone will keep on us because we might need it to repair the axe. Got additional hatches just in case. All right. So the only thing I really want to do is try to get back to our base over here, which is at, at home. And I just want to see if we can grab our cooking pot in our grill. And what we'll do is we'll just cook up some stuff uh, here, you know, at the base. Because uh, we're going to need some food and we're going to need some drink. Alright, we're going to grab that, grab that. Anything else we can bring? We need to bring that stuff, we'll bring that stuff, we'll bring that, that. Um, we'll bring the extra ammo. Okay, I think we're good. Oops. Alright, let's get on out of here. Hey, come on over to the come, come on over to the base, bud. I'll see you over there, all right? Love you. go oh actually you know what I forgot to put in that skill point let's do it real quick there we go Get some fire going. There we go. Oh, two bullets. I thought I reloaded it. Knocked them all down. Look at that. And <laughs> uh. hey, maybe the sledgehammer isn't so bad after all. 
big of a group. Let's go a pipe bomb. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, I destroyed my torch. Oh well. Oops, didn't mean to do that. I don't want them getting in here, so I'm gonna do a dub dubsy. Whoops. Can we repair the other one? Oh, they completely destroyed that one. Okay. Whoops. Oh, I think that's it. I don't think there's any more coming. We did a pretty good job holding them at this particular uh, place. At the front gates. So we know that it works. Let's uh, replace this one. There we go. Yeah, so uh, that wasn't bad. Let's repair this. We're definitely going to need some iron, uh, some iron hatches, but I don't think I'm going to upgrade it to iron hatches just yet. I mean, I might, you know, I, I think that's something that I might end up doing. Oh, the game's a little frozen. There we go. Uh, just because, you know, um, I think it'll be good to just kind of hold them off for a bit longer at the front. But uh, I don't think it's necessary, you know, because um, we're going to end up getting this a lot stronger at some point. And I actually do want them to kind of break through because, um, you know, once they do, uh, we'll be able to test out the rest of the base, you know? So, I don't have a problem with that. I think that this base held its own pretty good. There was minimal amount of damage. They uh, came directly to where we were. And, uh, you know, it worked out exactly the way that I wanted it to. So, uh, that wasn't bad. All right, I think we are pretty much good here. Did they destroy any of the land? I don't think so. They did a little damage to this. But that's fine. All right, guys, well, um, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode here. What I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm just gonna do some repair work at this point, and I'm also going to do some more upgrades with a little bit of stuff that I have left. And then we will pretty much go from there. So guys, I do appreciate all the support. And thank you guys so much for watching. It really does mean a lot. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I hope you guys are looking forward to seeing more. And I will catch you guys on the next episode.